Well, whether or not you live on the coast, do you have a deck that needs to be stained? Here to show us two different styles, Benjamin Moore, Sharon Grack. Thanks, boys. <laughs> distinct ways to do your yes. deck and I'm happy you've done them side by side so you can see the fun and the variety right. you can have when it comes to your deck. Exactly and you don't always think about color when it comes to the deck. You think about the furniture, you yes. think about the walls, but I really wanted to show how the deck can be an integral part of creating that beautiful style for your outdoor living. So Absolutely. I've got two looks. One's obviously very modern and formal, yep. black and white graphic. The other one I was definitely more inspired by the beach. It yes. has a more beachy, casual, laid back feel. Love it. So so let's talk about the formal one first. I think when we think about modern, I'm always drawn to more of an urban look. And you yeah. look to urban materials, steel, mm. um, brick. I love the painted brick. And more of a monochromatic palette or almost a no color palette. Right. <clears throat> so black and white and gray. You think about really minimal forms, simple lines, and in this case, really distinctive, substantial pieces. So you yes. don't just have a lot of clutter, you have pieces that are important and functional. So absolutely love the furniture. So this is like, I. yeah, again, I always get these pieces that you and I could both sit in very uh, comfortably. Yes. <laughs> it's nice and big and I love it's that It's nice about and it. big. So again, it sort of, whether it's a small space or a large space, it, yeah. it still, it fills it. So this is really nice and substantial. I love the side, little side table. So it's everything's cute. very angular yes. and sort of purposeful. So the furniture is gorgeous from Jardin de Ville. Lovely. And then I wanted to bring in an element that's a bit more poppy. So with the deck, when you, you can use solid stains over anything. So in this case, I used um, Arbor Coat Solid Stain in black. Mm -hmm. And then for a bit of contrast, I used Silver Satin, or sorry, Silver Mist, which is a bit of a bluey gray. It's lovely, that color. Isn't it really pretty? Mm -hmm. And I like how it feels white without being too um, too crisp. Yes. So, and again, you know what? You're going to walk on it. It's your deck. It's outside. Yeah. You know, we've had that conversation. Right. About, get over about it. Get over it. Get so, over it. You know what? You You're can just hold it, it down and clean it. Yes. Yeah. So we've got that nice pop of color in the stain. And then I use Oxford White to paint the brick. So mm -hmm. it's just a very, this is a bit more of a crisp look. Um, but again, I really love how it sets off the white on white. And you can have a little bit of fun even with that modern, more formal style. So yes. I think these kind of add a little bit of an exotic or a very pretty touch. Um, with again the white on white, the hits of gold, and then plants. You've got to have plants no matter how modern you are, whether it's yes. cactuses or beautiful lilies. But I think that element of green just really works with the style. But again, you can see there's not a natural wood source in here, which mm -hmm. I think you could still have. But I like how we've kind of used um, a semi transparent stain and the solid stain, so you kind of get a little bit of you both. You get them. a little bit of texture. I love the I love the idea of a planter with a with that it big impact Isn't in that nice? inside there. Exactly. That's really nice. Really really. Okay. Nice. So moving over so into beach vibes. Move to the beach. So um, this is really lovely. And this is this is a semi-permanent, or is it a semi? This is a semi-transparent. Semi-transparent. Exactly. And the thing is, we use a lot of semi-transparents. And again, you think of natural wood tones. Yeah. Which, of course, you can get cedar, mahogany, all of those natural wood colors. But adding a little bit of color, I used a color called Creekside Green. Okay. So there's a pretty, um, there's a limited palette yeah. of semi-transparent colors, but there's greens and blues. And again, I just really liked how that sort of felt a little bit more natural. Natural, right. but not sort of a dark walnut tone. And I absolutely fell in love with this deck lounge chair it's at JDV nice. again. So it kind of inspired that whole feel. So mm -hmm. you just want to, and again, if you sit in that one, you won't get back out. Oh, really? That happened to me last <laughs> night when I was supposed to be setting up. So. <laughs> a good one. Right? It's yeah. awesome. So again, that green kind of informs the whole look. Um, we've got, in this case, we've got natural wood. So to get that beachy laid back, you want to have the natural wood. That's mm -hmm. why I really like that semi-transparent stain. That's going to wear really well, even though we've got a clear coat on it. It's going to wear really well, and it doesn't require too much maintenance, but just sort of covering a little bit more of the translucent on top. It gives but it a bit of a hue. Like it, it still it, looks like wood, but exactly. it just gives it a little bit it of a hue. It's got a little bit nice. more to it. Um, so again, this is really fun. Like a natural wood fence would look fantastic, but yes. again, these are really fun. These reed fences, they're really inexpensive. They're a great way to hide maybe if you have a chain link fence. Yes. And you kind of want to get That's a little true. bit more privacy, right? Mm -hmm. So these are really easy to install. And you know what? They're only six feet high, so you can still see, oops, yep. you can still see above. And then the lighting, so the sort of tiki hut feel. I thought that was yeah, really fun cute. to add. And those, you know, again, all these different ways that you can bring a little bit of color and life to your outdoor yes. living space. But don't forget about the deck. Don't forget about right? the deck. So many people are having so much fun with these sort of fairy type lights yeah. right across. They're so, so lovely. Styles. They're really nice. 